Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Lottie and today we're going to be reviewing the Breville Toaster and Kettle Set. I picked this up off Amazon and it had a deal at the time. I've had it for a couple of weeks now, so I thought I'd give you a full review on how I feel about the set in itself. So we actually bought this set because we originally had a red set and we've actually done the kitchen up to be more in link with the house. So we're going for the greys, the whites and the blacks. Um, I picked this set as well because it was the cheapest one out of all the other sets that I could find that had some sort of nice detail on and went just a plain, you know, a plain, boring, cheap looking set. The downsides of this though is it has a rim around the side, I don't know if you can see that, and all of the dirt on the crumbs seem to get stuck in there. I mean it's fine um, to use my hoover on it and I'm going to show you how I do that in a minute to hoover them up. Um, but that's one downside that I don't like about it. As for the kettle, I haven't found anything that I don't like about it yet. This glows up blue, which is really nice. Um, it kind of has a smearing effect, I guess, on the stainless. But you could just get a nice stainless uh, steel spray to do that. Um, it's just really... Yeah, it's just a really nice kettle to have. I like this one. And it's nice and tall as well. The toaster also gets these marks along here but I found out that if I use the pink stuff they just go away straight away so I'm going to show you how I do that as well um, but apart from that it's super easy to clean it has the slips out the back oh my goodness I'm going to clean this too um, yeah the slips out the back to take the crumbs out which are nice and easy to do and then throw them in the bin and apart from that I'm absolutely loving it oh I thought I'd let you know as well that people have been saying online they don't know how to work it. You have to always use slot number one. Um, even if you need four pieces, you need to use slot one and then two. You can't ever just use two. I don't know why, but that's the way it's made. Um, and it has all of the different dials for the heat setting at the bottom. It's got a defrost setting and it's got a, a grill setting, I think, as well. Um, but I haven't used any of them, so let's get on to cleaning it. So to clean it, I just use my handheld shark hoover and it's super easy. You just go around the sides with the, the thin nozzle and it tends to pick up all the dirt really, really fast. So we're going to do that first. And then to get rid of the marks off of here, you just use a little bit of pink stuff on a cloth and then rub it away. Once it's all off, I just give it a quick buff and it comes up shining like new. Like so. So overall, I'm really happy with this set and how it's turned out and how easy it is to clean both of them. They seem to be a very good quality set and there's no sort of like peeling or anything on the metal. So I'm really happy with how it all looks and I would 100% recommend this set. Thanks for watching. Please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you all again soon. Bye!